Shipman and King opened the Embassy Braintree. This was the first of many subsequent Shipman and King theatres to have the name Embassy. Leslie Kemp and Tasker managed to design a 1,005-seater on a restricted site that had been previously occupied by the Shipman and King-controlled palace. Of the partnership, Sam King managed the day-to-day -day affairs of the circuit and A.R. Shipman was the financial director. He had a brother, Mick Shipman, who joined the company on its formation in 1920 and for many years was booking manager. Circuit supervisor was A.E. Randall. By 1926, the circuit consisted of the Montpellier Picture and Variety Theatre, Woolworth, the Super Cinema, Walthamstow, the Hoddesdon Cinema, the Electric Palace, Rye, the Picture House, Crowborough, the Picture Theatre, Tenterden, the New Pavilion, Hawley, the Pavilion, Hailsham, and the Hippodrome, Malden. Only the Pavilion Hailsham was an SNK built cinema at this time, but in nearly every situation where they were represented, Shipman and King would eventually build a brand new theatre. All the purpose built ones were luxurious and mostly of about 1,000 seats, because this was the size Shipman and King considered economic. Occasionally they built larger theatres, but from 1935 onwards, never smaller. At Rygate, Shipman and King went into partnership with H. Bancroft and took over the Hippodrome. This was modernised and re-equipped and the refurbished auditorium seated 850. Buildings to the right of the Hippodrome were demolished to make way for a new access road to a brand new cinema, the Majestic. The Majestic opened in November 1935. It was to be the largest theatre ever operated by the circuit, with close on 2,000 seats. The Majestic was designed by Wisbeach architects Ward and Woolner, who had designed other cinemas for H. Bancroft, notably the Empire Wisbeach. Bancroft had cinema interests in March, Ely, Holbeach and Peterborough, but only at Rygate was he associated with Shipman and King. The projection room had two Cayley 11 projectors and a Western Electric 2AM wide-range sound system when it opened. In July 1973, when these photographs were taken, this original equipment was still going strong. A.R. Shipman and S.S. King never set up in opposition to another cinema. Before building a new cinema, they would acquire any existing cinema in a time. The Shipman and King circuit specialised in having pairs of cinemas in country towns, usually an older one and a new one specially built. Rygate is a typical example. The organ was a six-rank Christie, as supplied to other S&K theatres, and this was a particularly fine one. The Embassy Malden was opened in March 1936 by Shipman and King, where they were already represented by the Hippodrome. The Embassy had 1,250 seats, a cafe and a Wurlitzer organ. This was unusual, as the circuit normally bought cheaper Christie models. The Embassy Pets Wood, close to Orpington in Kent, opened in October 1936. It was a typically luxurious Shipman and King property, designed by David Evelyn Nye, and seated 1,350. The embassy closed in April 1973, was demolished and the site redeveloped. <laughs> 